Could you share uh, the uh, permitting concerns that you may have had for the the mine that's supposed to go in along the lake down in the Porkies and the possibility of leaching acid into the lake? Well, first of all, we had very little concerns about acid leaching. Um, that ore was similar to the white pine ore, almost identical, a calcasite. And, and, it, and you need sulfide, oxygen, and water to generate acid. And they do have that, but they also have a buffering agent, kind of like an antacid. That calcasite buffers that ore. So you're not getting the acid drainage concerns. But do we not, do we, do we then just say, yeah, we're not going to be concerned about chemistry? Absolutely not. Any kind of, copper doesn't necessarily need an acid environment to be leached out. So our statute doesn't um, specifically address acid mine drainage. It does talk about it, but it goes far beyond that. It says leaching. So any of your material to you take out of the ground, whether it's rocks, tailings, or whatever, it's the leachability and it getting into the ground. And what is that ability? What's that possibility? So all the geochemistry work that's done on it, all these samples that they take, they run them for months and months, and then they determine at the end when they pull their sample out, what is the water quality going to look like? And it's kind of a worst case scenario. So then they, 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 they say, all right, we can't just put this on the ground. We have to line it. So acid mine drainage wasn't a real big concern up the 